Hello everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to a brand new episode of Fishing at Sim World. And guys, let's go over to Lake Williams today. Uh, this is basically a spin fishing map, which is why I've never fished here. Uh, but I've, you know, mainly gotten this game for bottom fishing, but you know what? I've bottom fished so much. All of my episodes are all about bottom fishing. I'm slowly transitioning over to spin fishing because why not, you know, use uh the all the features that the game provides so on this map in lake williams which is in california uh fire ridden basically we need to evacuate as soon as we see smoke uh there's large and smallmouth bass spotted bass Ooh, three different types of bass we have perch bluegill and two types of crappies black and white crappie i honestly want the bluegill uh but you know what? I'm happy to catch all of these fish. So, le so let's uh, go ahead. Make this afternoon because for some reason this game is extremely dark. Carp bass default. What is the bass default? I don't even know. All right. Uh, clear skies. We have light cloud, heavy rain, dynamic. Let's just keep it clear skies because I like uh, to have a little bit of light, I think. You know, nighttime is really dark. I bet if it's cloudy, it's going to be really dark. Uh, so a clear, sunny day where it just feels so good to be out and about. Alrighty. I think we should start right over here. Yeah. I think I've done this in Bass Pro Shops Edition. This exact same lake. So I'm not going to go in this cluster. I'm just going to stick out here. And let's see what we can get ourselves into. Guys, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below. I really appreciate all the support. Okay, so. Uh, carp, 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 12. Sorry, we don't need carp. We need predator, bass. Predator, bass, 7. Predator, bass... Okay, so this is our best rod yet. Uh, this is our strongest reel, line, and soft plastic. I don't know. I guess this is going to have to do for now. Uh, I'm going to try and fish from the dock here. I don't know which way. Oh, look at that. That way might sound good. And then we will take out the boat and maybe even troll. I don't know if there's even troll. In this game i really don't know uh lower the speed here increase the resistance to 30 and let's see what we can get ourselves into any fish i'm starting to miss bass pro shops uh underwater camera <laughs> but this is gonna have to do this will be fine all right, so I'm going to keep fishing here. Usually when they're fish around, you will actually see them, I don't know, float. So I'm close to the surface for some reason, so you know there's fish out, uh, around. But I guess there's nothing here, so I will uh, move, maybe go towards those islands there. So I've uh, switched my lure to Deluxe Frog Gold here. Let's cast and see. Uh, I am at the island now. The islands. Now it's such an odd looking lake. It's really cool how like these islands came to formation, you know? Uh, where the entire ground is like, you know, six, seven meters deep and these islands just out of nowhere. It's really cool geology, I guess you could say. And uh, yeah. Cool stuff. Let's throw it once more. And see, yeah, so um, since there's only small fish here, there's no point you, there's no point using a six inch lure. So I'm just using this two inch topwater frog thing. And I'll keep switching it up. I think that was a fish. Ooh, that's a perch. 
Yeah. Imagine if this is a trophy perch, because that guy looked huge. Wow. Oh, you know what? It's a bass, probably, not a perch. I forgot their bass here. <laughs> Uh, but wow, like my brakes were just a little bit high and it was all the way in the red. It was at 30 brakes. Is that a bass? That has to be a bass. Now, there are three different species of them, so that's pretty cool. We'll have a good variety. The depth is... See, all of a sudden. I gotta reduce the brake way too much. This setup is just not good enough. Something is off in the setup. Uh, 9 meters out distance. Sorry, depth 6 meters deeper the fish is. I don't know how we know this information. But it's extremely accurate. Maybe inside our hook. Uh, we have like sensors. <laughs> That detect, you know, that ping out sonar. Uh, but yeah, very interesting. <laughs> oh, look, now our brake isn't high enough. It's getting away. Come on, Fisher, you can do it. Oh, yeah, if I right click, I can do this. Yeah. Ooh, that is a bass and that is a watermelon bass. Oh, that is a nice size. A trophy catch right off the bat. Nice. Uh, let's go ahead, toggle view. Let's take a screenshot. 6.67 kg largemouth bass. That is a trophy. That is sweet. And this is that force perception people talk about. When you get a fish and you want to make it look bigger, uh, you hold it away from you closer to the camera. So, you know, like I cannot literally show you. Uh, but if you look at his hand, he has it extended and the fish is closer to the camera. So the fish looks like it's going from, you know, his neck all the way to his thigh area. And no, the fish isn't that big. But it's just showing that big. So that is really darn cool. I like it. Nice. Right off the bat too. Alright. I am going to cast just a little bit to the right here. And you know what guys? I think uh, this top lure. This frog or whatever it is. Uh, this is the secret. It's, it's working. Maybe it's the spot. I don't know. Uh, but it definitely has to be this lure. Look at that. Already a strike. Come on. Come on. I'm gonna spam right click so it can... We can raise its mouth up. Damn it, fish! 15 a break. That is pathetic. Compared to our bottom setups where we can crank it up to 40 break and not have to worry. Uh, but they purposely just, you know, in spin fishing, I guess the fish aren't really that big. So they're like, you know what, let's just only include the weak gear. Oh man, come on. Ten meters out. Going to, ooh, 7.98 meter depth, 8.2, it's moving away from the island. Nine, ten meter depth. Holy moly, that's deep. Ooh, is that a black bass or is that a spotted bass? I've never seen either one in real life. Or have I? I wouldn't even know, honestly. Come on, fishy, you can- Ooh, look at the backdrop though. Those dry, arid California mountains. And it's sort of like hazy, like the dust is being flown around. Uh, it's pretty cool. I like it. Just don't smoke or throw matches in there, cause... Yeah. 
Then we're gonna have airplanes, you know, swooping it down to get water, and we're gonna get scooped up and thrown onto fire. And there we go. The fish is like, no, I don't wanna go. Ooh, that is a spotted bass. That has to be. Oh, another trophy catch! Deluxe frog gold. Guys, if you want bass, uh, that's the lure, and this is the spot. 4.08 kg. 0.6 meters actually that's huge uh, 0.6 meters is huge wow and that is a beautiful fish all right let's cast again let's cast right back and do what we do best which is retrieving <laughs> at speed two retrieval retrieval we know how to retrieve Except when we get a fish on. And we spook out. Ah. Oh my god, what? Seriously? I don't know why the stupid game does that. Like, it's not even working. What? Hey, we got a fish anyway. That was weird. What the heck was that? I guess we're not that good at retrieving, guys. Let us cast right there. Yeah, so basically, guys, there's a lot of bass here. Like, holy moly, there's a lot of bass. And they look so big, some of them. Uh, so, you know what? I just want one species of every other fish, basically. So I think after we catch all three types of bass, I don't know if I already have. Uh, once we have, I think I should just move. Because uh, I want the bluegill the most. And perch. Come on. That's so annoying you cannot even cast far enough. That's just so stupid. Alright, so cat summary. Large mouth, small mouth. Ah, oh, we don't have spotted bass. Yeah, you know what? So we're going to have to stay a while for those guys. Okay, we got him. Poor bite, but who cares? Uh, right before this, uh, I was reeling it in. I hooked, you know what, a fish bit, and I, it's this exact same problem. I yanked the rod. I was reeling it in, but for some reason, it was unsuccessful. So... I'm just going to spam a right click. We can keep the fish at surface. And I hope it's a, uh, a spotted bass. What the hell was that? That sound. That is not good. I think it's the game. Uh, hopefully it's not my... My sound. Or my headphone driver or something like that. Because that means uh, there's static buildup and that is not good. You can kill your hardware like that. So hopefully that is only in this game. Uh, I was recording a Fisher Online just before this. And I did not have the sound glitch. And this is the second time it has happened in this game now. I think it might just be this spot. So... This fish is just taking us around town, you know. Doing whatever it wants to do. We just gotta wait here. Using, like, this tiny little reel. And it looks like the reel, like, your kids would use, you know? <laughs> I think I mentioned it in the previous video. It just looks... It looks so silly, this reel. Yep, take the line out. I got all day. Now look at the island. Look how lush and green it is. And then look at the mountains. When we look that way. How arid it is. Uh, it doesn't make any sense to me. Like what? It rains only here because of the lake? Alright. That's so weird. Or maybe. Yeah. You know what? No. Only the trees can have roots deep enough to... Oh, wow. 
Look at the tummy on that guy. Oh. That is a trophy catch. Large mouth bass. Damn. That is a fat boy, isn't it? Nice. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Okay, we got another one. What could this be? Man, that last bass was so fat. I've never seen a bass that fat. And you know what? For a moment there... Ah. Uh, ah, uh, that was bullcrap. My hook... My hook set time was slow, so it was like, Oh no, we're not gonna give that to you. Man, that's stupid. Anywho, as I was saying... What was I saying? Crap, I forgot. Anywho, uh... What was I talking about? Yeah, you know, uh, when I caught that fish. It was a trophy fish, but it still said large mouth bass. Uh, so for a moment I was like, wait, hold on. Am I playing Baz Pro Shops Edition or am I playing just the regular Sim World Pro Edition? You know, because so far I think all the trophies I've caught have had special names. I was like, wait, hold on. <laughs> Did I mess it up? Uh, so I minimized the game and I looked and yeah, it is. It is the sim world game I'm playing. It's not Bass Pro Shops. So I guess there's going to be so many small, large mouth bass trophies that I guess they just won't be named. And the named ones in terms of trophies, they might be much, much bigger. So 6kg might be a trophy, but the named bass trophies might be, uh, you know, like 10kg or something. Uh, so I just freaked out. For a moment there. Look at those beautiful mountains again. Oh, not again. What? Seriously? I wasn't even maxing out the drag. Oh, this is frustrating. I've never had this game at this frustrating before. Maybe third fish is the charm. I'm also keeping my resistance up. Which is so stupid because, you know, I have to play around with going up and down with the resistance. But I thought, you know, maybe my resistance went too low. Which is why the fish got away. Uh, large? Large mouth? Yeah. And where am I going to find the spotted bass? I think it's time we move. Looks like we got something here. Looks like a bass to me. I'm just hoping it's a spotted bass though. Interesting color. And it was a good, uh, good hook. Which means we shouldn't be able to unhook the fish. Let's reel this guy in. Uh, I'm sure some of you already know what fish this is. But I don't, so... Ooh. Please be a spotted bass. Oh, it's a smallmouth bass. Dang it. Ah. Uh, so there are perch here as well. I did see a tiny little perch. I was fishing right over there behind his cap. If I remember correctly. Was I there? Yeah, I think I was there. Where are we? Uh, yeah, we just went up a little bit, I think. It's, I can't even, you know, uh, maximize the map, you know, zoom in. Let me keep fishing. Looks like another bass, guys. But, yeah, I think it's the exact same problem as Bass Pro Shops Edition. The bass are everywhere, but the perch... And the crappy and the bluegill are like the rarest fish. It's so hard to get them. This fish is seriously annoying. 
Okay, let's put it at 16. Maybe 16 a break works better. Okay, good. He's done. Oh, boy. What is this guy? Look at that stomach again. Trophy, catch, large, mouth, 5.37 kg. I love the color on the fish. That tummy, though, is legit. Nice. Another bass. Uh, this has been, like, the most frustrating adventure yet. On slow retrieval, every single fish I'm getting is a poor hook. And I've lost... Five, six fish at least now due to poor hook. You cannot even hook a good time in the slow retrieval. So I think that is the issue with slow retrieval. You want to go with speed two and not one. In speed one, it stays in the water for longer, the lure. And fish are still interested in it. Uh, when you go faster speed, as I said, you're the guy... Throws the, throws the rod, or throws the line like a wimp. Uh, you only throw like 30 meters and within 5 seconds you've already reeled the line in. Which is really annoying. But I thought, you know what, let's do a slow uh, reel here. Have the lure inside in the water for longer, on the water rather. And just catch more fish. And it is true the fish are biting more. Because we have a higher chance, you know, being in the water. But, uh, the hook rate is just atrocious. So what I'm going to do is, uh, there are only bass here, as you can see. So I am going to teleport to, let's, let's go over here. Uh, maybe, you know, those types of fish are in different parts of the map. I'm going to go by the rocks over there. All right, I think... This is my first good strike in forever, and I think we might have a... <gasps> yes! Is that a blue kill? Oh, is that a... No, that's a black crappy, isn't it? That's a white crappy. Okay, I guessed every single thing and I got them all wrong. <laughs> yes, finally, guys, I found the spot. I found the bloody spot. It's right here. Let me show you guys. Yes, so, uh... On over here, Sunnyville boat ramp, I believe this is. And it just come over to this thing here. The boat ramp is right over there behind us. And we're coming right down to this, this geological uh, point of interest. This rock, whatever the heck this is, I forgot. <laughs> the name isn't coming to me, okay? Uh, but yeah, this is it. This is it, guys. I think we might... Get the smaller fish here, so let me keep fishing here and see. Okay, we got something here. Oh, look at that baby little crappy. They're gonna be white as well. <gasps> That's a black crappy and it's a trophy. Oh my god, yes! Yes! 0.85 kg. That's legit. Guys, you know what? With the slow retrieval speeds, it's atrocious. Every single bite is terrible. So I had to crank up the speed a little bit, and even then, I couldn't do it. So white crappy, black crappy, large and small mud bass. Give me just a moment. Let me see if I can catch something. And that looks like a bass. Bzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzz
Guys, this is this is going to be it for my adventure of the day. I really hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below. And this spot is right over here. The escarpment is right there behind my hat. That spot only had one fish. That was that cr white crappy. So I had to move over here. I'm getting fish here. Uh, so if you want to try it out, it will be over here, which is somewhere over here. Unfortunately, this map is absolute trash because you cannot zoom in to give you an accurate uh, place. Anywho, hopefully I will see you on my next adventure. Until the very next time, guys. Enjoy.